booktube it's missy and today i went to the mailbox and i got two packages now this is from my trade away so one package is from indiana gal 77 which is this one and then the other one is from shauna potter which is this one both of these girls live in the states and so i got the boxes already um i'm still waiting on amy gad her her um, trade away box is coming from England, so it's gonna take a little while. So I, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna split this video up. I'm gonna tape this portion now, and then you'll see future Missy with that part before I upload the video. I just really need to open these boxes, so I didn't wanna wait until later. All right, so let's dig in. We got the first box. from um, Indiana Gal, or Andrea. Thank you very much. This is a crazy big box, so I don't, I don't know what's in here. <gasps> no, you didn't. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, I, all right, so. I'm so excited. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Andrea. So she sent me not one, but two books, and I got Mr. Mercedes and its sequel, Finders Keepers. Oh, look, I'm so excited. This is the Hodges. What's his first name? Hmm. Bill Hodges? Is it Bill Hodges? Um, trilogy, the third book, which comes here, doesn't come out in June, doesn't come out until June. And these are going to be my Stephen King 2016 read-along books for this summer. Mr. Mercedes is going to be in June. Uh, Finders Keepers is going, oops, I'm backwards. Mr. Mercedes is in June. Finders Keepers is in July. And then the third book and the third and final book will be for August. Oh, I'm so excited. Thank you so, so much, Indiana Gal slash Andrea. I cannot believe you sent me these. I'm, I'm so stinking excited. Thank you. Thank you. Yay! All right. And the next package is from Shauna Potter. So thank you, Shauna. Uh, let's open up your package. Where is it? I'll open it this way. Alrighty, do one more cut. Okay. Ooh, you, did you make this box yourself? This is amazing. It's like folded in half and folded in half again. I love it. Ugh, that beats going and buying a box. Okay. Ooh. All right. So it's wrapped in newspaper. I love things wrapped in newspaper. I don't know why. It just seems very like old fashioned and I just love that. Okay, so let's see what's under the paper. Yee! I know I picked these out, but I'm still so stinking excited. Okay, so she also sent me two books because she's super sweet and thank you, thank you very much. All right, so the two books that I got was Insanity by, uh, what's his name? Cameron Jace and his other series, which is the Grim Diaries, Snow White Sorrow, um, also by Cameron Jace. I own, I own Insanity on my Kindle. And then a couple months ago, uh, I was really excited because then they had Insanity, like a bind up of books one through three for free or 99 cents, something like that on my Kindle. And so I bought, bought that one too. And then I realized, oh my gosh, they have them in paperback and I love reading physical books more than ones on the Kindle and so I ended up um, putting all of these in my on my wish list for Amazon and she just so happened to have it so yay I have the first book in the series I believe it is four books altogether maybe five I think it's four but look I just love this picture very reminiscent of Alice Alice 
uh, in Wonderland, like Madness Returns, like the video game, except for, you know, that one has a black-haired girl, but awesome. And then this one, I do have the Grimm Diaries, the prequels on my Kindle because that one was free. And so I'm so excited to have another uh, physical copy of this. Cameron Jace has tons of retellings for, you know, fairy tales on Amazon for the Kindle. So if you guys are interested in reading a retelling, I would check it out. But um, I really can't wait to read both of these. So thank you so, so much, Shauna. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Oh, look, oh, 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 no, no. oh I totally did. All right. So, so far, these are my four books. You girls are so amazing. Thank you again. And this wraps up the first part of this video. You guys just watched the first two unboxings of Indiana Girl 77 and Shauna Potter. Um, they both won the trade away for last month. And here are two more packages. And these two are from Sylvia over at Wish Fulfillment. I sent her Come, Come Closer by Sarah Gran. And so she sent me these two books in return. Um, so let's open them. I'm super excited. Uh-oh. Well, I was going to try and rip it open like a Neanderthal, but I think I'll just use a box cutter and slice the top so much easier. All right, so she sent me, this one is quite a thick book, yay! She sent me Ink Death. This is the third book in the uh, Ink, it's not Ink Heart Trilogy. What is it called? I don't know. Um, I've been wanting to read this for a while. This is by Cornelia Funk and I never picked it up and so I'm looking forward to reading it. I do, oh look, underneath the dust jacket is the same as the dust jacket. Very pretty. Um, so yay, so this is the third book and I'm assuming that this one is the first book. Let me open that one. Ah, okay, and here is the first book. So this one is in paperback. This one is in hardcover. Um, I do need to get Ink Spell, which is the second one, to complete my trilogy. I can't wait to read these. Let me know down below if you have read this series. What do you think of them? I know that it's about... Um, like a father who can go into books? Is that what that is? Like he's the bookkeeper or something? I don't know. Um, I saw the movie a really long time ago. That's with Brandon Fraser, right? I saw it once and I didn't even watch the whole thing. Um, cause by that time I was like in high school and I thought that little kid movies were dumb. But little did I know, little kid movies are awesome as an adult. Uh, anyways, so those are the two books from Sylvia. Thank you so much, Sylvia. I have gotten my two packages from Amy. There was a mishap in the mail. And if you can see, it just got ripped up. And it says, we care from the post office. I, I don't know what happened. But there's like a giant gouge. And there a big, huge rip in the front. And it's just, it's just sad. But I finally got it, Amy, so thank you very much. First broken up bag. Uh, oh, let's see. Oh, look at that. It's just, it's just awful. It's just so mutilated. Um, let me just open up from the rip, I guess. Ooh. Oh my gosh, she sent me so much stuff. Oh, how cute. Okay, so first thing, oh, <laughs> so cute. First things first, we have a, oh, oh no. Uh, we have a bear 
Look how stinking cute this is. This is my keychain, my new one. I'm going to stick on my keys immediately. Um, it kind of reminds me of the, you know, Goldilocks and the Three Bears, but the sister version. And we also have, oh my gosh, <laughs> it's kind of like poo, but a pirate poo. We don't know what happened to this cute yellow bear. He has had an accident, but we love him anyway. So super excited to add these to my keychain. I can't wait. I can't wait. Next we have, let's see, let's see. We have gold necklaces, so we have a heart and an M for Missy. Thank you for thinking of me. That is amazing. I love it. And hair ties. You can never have enough hair ties. Being a girl, hair ties are extremely important. These are extremely decorative. I love them. Ooh, it's so pretty. Mine are so boring. Do I even have one? Here's one off my floor. Boring. And it's got tons of hair in it. Ugly. These ones, ugly, gorgeous. Ugly, cute. All right. The next thing I have here is a couple more keychains. <laughs> this one's an underground keychain. Very London. And then we have a bear with friend on it. Am I guessing, Amy, that you like teddy bears? Because... They are very cute. And we have a couple bookmarks. They are bookworms. <laughs> I love it. Oh, I don't have any of these like hooky kind of bookmarks. All of mine are just the plain, like, you know, paper ones. So I like the ones that you can hook onto the page. Yay! Yay! Oh, there's still more stuff inside here. <gasps> oh my gosh. <gasps> oh. Hmm. That's what happens. You see that? Uh, Amy sent me a birthday present and it, it got all ripped up. I'm hoping the book is fine. Let's see what's in here. Our endless numbered days. Every parent lies, but some lies are bigger than others. Shocking and subtle, brilliant and beautiful recalls Ian McEwen by Claire Fuller. I have never heard of this book, but it is gorgeous. I love it. Look at how pretty and the blue and the silver and the trees. It's very ominous. Ooh, I can't wait to read this. Thank you so much. I am excited. I wasn't expecting a book. I give you one keychain and you spoiled me rotten. Thank you. All right, what else is in here? Oh, help me. More bookmarks. Yee! How do I open it? How do I open it? Um, um, can I just peel it back a little bit? Let's see what they look like. Come out. Oh, look it. It says bookmark and there's a hand. Ah, so you stick it in the book and then the hand just hangs out the top. Help me. You can grab the hands and pull them out. I love it. Oh my goodness. Amy, you are so sweet. And... There is a note, which I will read afterwards. So, we got bookmarks and keychains and some more cute keychains and some hair ties because we're girls and we can't get enough. And this beautiful book that I don't know anything about, but I'm going to find out immediately. I'm so stinking excited. Look at that. I didn't even show you guys the uh, spine. You can't tell, but it's shiny. Nice and silver. And, yes! So this concludes my uh, trade away giveaway. I know it was pretty long in the making, but um, I am super excited to all of you ladies who sent me things. Thank you so, so much. And I hope you guys have a wonderful week. I don't have any books yet for April or for March, so we might have to skip March and then go to April. Hopefully I can get through a couple more books this month so I can share them with you guys. Um, thanks. That's it. 